What's going on guys, it's Eve here back with another video. Today's video is going to be a little bit different. I'm going to be showing you how to get custom decals such as the one that you're seeing right now, um, Levi from Attack on Titan, and many others for free in Rocket League. Um, just an example, right? Let's say you don't like Levi, there's a Juice World decal. <clears throat> uh, there's also Rengoku, there's all kinds of stuff, but I think the um, Levi one is definitely one of my favorites not only that how to get a custom banner as you see right here I have Yurichi and you can also get custom balls wheels and other stuff um, but in this video I'm just gonna be covering the decal and the banner but as you can see I have an iridescent ball and just proof that it works go to this website here which will be linked in the description down below you click here to download it's gonna download I'm not gonna do it because I already have it you extract the files alright for those of you who don't know you just right click and then there's gonna be an option that says extract all if there's not uh, it's gonna look something like like this extract all and if it's not you're just gonna go to show more options and it should be an option okay <laughs> Once you've installed that, you're going to go here to Bacchus Plugins, which also will be linked in the description, and you're going to download Alpha Console. If it doesn't show up here for you, of course, you can just type it and then search, and it should be one of the first things to pop up, probably the first thing. And then you're going to install with Bacchus Mod. So once you click that, you're going to get a prompt, and you're just going to put allow or OK, whatever it says. And uh, if you don't have Bogus Mod open, it'll tell you that it's going to install the next time Bogus Mod is open. If you currently have it open and you are running Rocket League, it will install then, and then you have to restart your game for it to actually show up. Okay, so after you do that, what you're going to want to do is go to Open Bogus Mod. And once you open it, it's going to show up like this, but it's not going to say Injected if you don't have Rocket League open. I have Rocket League open, so mine says Injected. You want to go to File, Open Bogus Mod Folder. So we are now here. Okay, you're gonna want to go to data AC plugin, which is Alpha Console, the thing we just downloaded. And then, depending on what you're downloading, it's gonna depend on where you go. Me personally, we're gonna do a decal right now, so we're gonna go to decal textures, and this is where your custom decals are going to be. You want to leave this open. Me personally, I click these three dots and I pin it to quick access, uh, quick access so it shows up right here, so I can get to it very easily and very quick so minimize that you want to keep it open though so we know where it's at if you close it no big deal just go through that step again <clears throat> and you're gonna to want to go to this website which will also be linked in the description um, so like I said for this one we're gonna get a decal and I'm gonna show you how to do that I use Octane quite a bit there's also Fennec, Dominus, uh, Nissan Silvia there's a whole bunch of cars and stuff on here but for this example we're gonna go through and get let's see well um, we'll do this one the Liberty Walk Octane okay so what you do <clears throat> once you click one that you like just scroll down to where you see the blue download button you hit it it's gonna download you open that file location, okay? Which is just gonna be in your downloads. For those of you who don't know, once you download something, just go to your downloads and it will be there. Now, you wanna open that decal textures that we left open. You wanna drag it over here. And then you wanna right click. So as you can see, there's no extract all. So we're gonna go to show more options. I have 7-zip installed, but if you don't, it should still give you an option. I'm putting extract here. So what that's going to do is it's just going to extract it directly to that decals texture and I don't have to choose the file. So there, I've extracted it. I can delete that now because it should be here somewhere. Which I'm actually not sure where I went. Oh, right here. And to make sure that it's going to work, the main thing that you want to make sure 
the main file that you're looking for after you download one and extract it is this right here. If it's a text document and it says texture packages or something along those lines, that means it is most likely going to work. Um, some creators leave notes in there. But uh, we're just going to go ahead and minimize this. And we're going to show you that it works. So we need to close Rock League and let it fully close. Once it fully closed, this will actually tell me that it needs to, that I can inject it somewhere else. And there that goes, Rocket League Steam up to date. Just open up Rocket League with Baka's mod open. Wait for that to open. Okay. And then you want to hit F2, which is the Bacchus mod uh, keybind. That's going to open all your Bacchus mod settings. Okay, these are more for like training when you're in training. This is your items if you want to change like your wheels or something. Um, like I see OEM, black, that's what I have on. But for those custom decals that we just installed, we're going to go to plugins, alpha console. If it doesn't show up here, just open the plugin manager, find alpha console, check it and that's it so then alpha console toggle alpha console menu you're gonna wanna go to cosmetics right here the second tab and then you're gonna scroll down to where you see decal texture mod you can uh, obviously blue team orange team I think right now I have the blue team so we're just gonna look for it and look for the file which it should have been LW octane gonna click it I'm going to go ahead and set it for both teams. And there we go. We have the Liberty Walk decal. Um, some of them will actually change the whole color of your car. Some of them won't. I'm guessing this isn't one of those. Since it's letting me. Yeah. So either way, it looks plain. <laughs> um, Liberty Walk. That is how you do the decals. Now for banners, it is a bit different. We are going to go ahead and close this because we're going to have to restart it anyway after we install a banner. So, you're just going to go back to that page. If you're like me and you don't close it, you just go back to view mods. Type in banner or just scroll through and look for one. I currently have the Arichi and the Tanjiro one installed. Um, let's go... And those titles, guys, they are just banners that'll tell you that you're SSL or whatever you download, which is pretty cool either way. Um, I'm not seeing a whole bunch of banners, so we're going to go back to that first page. And we'll download the Akatsuki. Same thing. You should go down, download. What you see it downloads as a PNG, so we open that, minimize, open Bacchus mod, file, open Bacchus folder, data, AC plugin, and then here we're going to go to banner textures. So this one is going to be a little bit different. This one, we're actually just going to drop it here. And so now you want to go into this texture packages, you can close this one which it's going to ask you for the first time what you want to open it in. I always do it in notepad. So then you're just going to get a whole bunch of code and text like this. Um, don't freak out. It's a lot more simple than you think. So first things first, um, the only ones that you're going to have are the PS1, PS4, Steam, Twitch, Xbox. Any other ones that you do, you do have to do them manually. So what you want to do is take any one of these from the comma here and go down typically want to do it on the last one because that little bracket right here is very important and then control C or right click and copy go here right beside it and then paste so as you see now I have two tundra banner which we're gonna change that so now we want to name this one 
Well, it's just all caps, which is very important, guys. Banner dash Katsuki. You do not want to mess up when you type it here. This is where it really matters. And to make sure that you don't mess up, you just right click on it, properties, take this name, copy it, close it, and then right in front of the period, you just paste it. And then you leave the rest the same, file, you want to save it, close it, and then you can open Rocket League, which of course we're going to wait for it to open. I will cut to when it opens. All right. So you see we load in. Uh, sometimes when you load in, your stuff will not be there again. You just have to re-enable it. So again, F2 to open Bacchus Mod. Plugins, Alpha Console, Toggle Alpha Console, Cosmetics, and right here, it should be the second one, Banner Texture Mods. And I am looking for Banner, I could ski, and there you go. As you can see in the bottom left, it did change, and that, guys is how you get custom decals and custom banners in Rocket League um, another thing with Bacchus mod if you just go to items right decal it will have every decal that is in the game or almost every decal right like they have the uh, the old ones as well so if I type in octane energy that's the first energy decal or one of the first right but um, for those custom ones to work you must install them the way that I did and have no decal on. So to everyone else, you're going to have a plain octane. But to you, of course, it looks beautiful. So if you have any questions, let me know in the comments down below. I will do my best to get back to you and answer as soon as possible. Thank you for tuning in. And if you made it this far in the video, I love you. If you're new here, like, comment, subscribe. And I uh, hope to see you in the next one. Peace.